Hello, welcome back to Hungry on Plane. It is Tri Stuff Tuesday once again, and today we have the demo of a fun little indie game called Anode Heart. This is basically Pokemon with extra steps. Uh, no, <laughs> this is uh, RPG, a Monster Hunter RPG, which I didn't sound that unlike Pokemon, I guess. But I've, despite being a longtime Pokemon fan, have never played any of the other games in the genre, and there's quite a few of them. Never played Power World, never played uh, Monster Hunter, never played, I don't know. I can't think of all the other games, but I know there's been a few of them uh, over the course of uh, the time span of video games. So Anod Heart seems fun. Gives me, definitely gives me RPG energy. The music actually sounds a lot like um, the opening music to Final Fantasy VII Reactor. No, not Reactor. Genova, maybe? Something like that. Anyway, nice and dramatic. Some exposition happened, and uh, here we are. On circuit short. I'm out here vibing. I kind of look like Hollow Knight. Colonel Dart is missing. How will I ever make popcorn? Who's Muin? A cat. Look at me, I even look like a little Pokemon character. I'm so cute. Oh. It's it's mewing, right? We all hear that. Whatever I'm whatever daughter I'm acquiring sounds like a cat. We we can all agree. You're awake. Oh, I'm a program. I thought I was a person. Colonel Dump. Shishi the mechanic. I've been brought for repairs. So I'm a robot. Mechanica. I'm unrebootable. Do you have a name? I certainly do. Wait, I have a journal? Uh, sure, we can be sick. The art style in this game is wonderful, by the way. Why does every RPG have a strange mist? They just decided, like, you know what? We don't know what to do. Strange mist it is. Like Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles, literally, it's the mist. <laughs> All right, we're vibing. Uh, I don't think I need to save. Let me send it. Can't sleep in that one. Oh, I see. More tutorials. What about this? Oh! It is Pokemon. <laughs> Three egg-shaped objects. And now we must pick one. Prototype eggs. How did I do that? I just rolled up and hit space buff, fam. I'm just that good. Man, the music in this game is real good. The Tama that is about to hatch. I'm, I guess Tama is, no. Oh man, I should not be like scrounging my brain for grade eight Japanese. <laughs> I don't think Tama is egg. I know there's good Tama who's popular egg cartoon egg figure anyway eggs are happening i must get closer to the eggs you've met me like 30 seconds ago and i'm touching your like month-long project how did wait hang on. how did you set it up so only one of them would hatch how did you know all right whatever it doesn't matter oh baby this is dope all right what definitely not Pokemon do we want? So we have. Alright, we have Talfu. Talfu? A fire dog. Eats meat. Banger. It's a wolf. 75 HP, 85 strength, 100 magic, 65 speed, 25 wisdom. The passive is Cinders. My fire tech skin, one burn. We could have Kobu, an earth, Kobold Tama. 
to Lizard. 90% HP, 100% Strength, 75% Magic, 50% Speed, 35% Wisdom. Gain 2 armor whenever your Earth Tech does damage. That sounds pretty good. Or, boy, I can already tell you what we're going to do. Fifu, the Windbird Tama, can eat anything. Wait. Cobra only eats plants. The bird eats anything. 65% HP, 75% Strength, 85% Magic, 100% Speed, and 45 Wisdom. Gains 1 Speed up to... Gains one, gain one speed up for every speed up for every three wind techs use. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you I was gonna pick the one with the highest speed, but I think the bird's also the coolest. So we're locking in the bird. Do you want to give it a nickname? Maybe. No, I can't think of anything good. <laughs> I have to take care of it. All right. I like that I'm just already being trusted to go out into the mist island. This is like Ghost in the Shell meets Pokemon. I'm kind of into it. Mm. So I have digital Pokemon. Interesting. <laughs> Has there been a digital Pokemon anime series before? Sorry to say, I'm not, uh, don't know enough about Digimon to hit you with any lore. In case you find recruits. I assume that means more Tama. What's a sentient? Am I a sentient? Mr. Shishi's all alone. I think sentience must be robots that are people, which is, that's me. I'm a robot person. I don't even know who's hanging out there. I'm not talking to them. All right, I'm in the kernel dump. Can't jump. Savage. What do you want from me, Tutabot? Oh, I see. Ah, fine. Tutorial bot. I guess we should talk to tutorial bot. I will try and find more residents, yes. You can browse the internet for me? Wait, why does the robot have a modem? Wait, who is tutoring me? Oh, here's Tutorbot. Hello. Yes, I would like to see Combat Basics. I feel like I probably don't need to do this, but like... Also, playing Pokemon with a mouse is like very trippy. Oh. There's so many words. Once you go over your remaining TP, it's your opponent's turn. So it's like, kind of like a, not a tactic team necessarily, but an action point system more than just purely turn-based. Enemy turn. Wait. Oh, here's my TP? Hang on. Okay. I'm like, want to say I understand, but I think I would be lying. I definitely don't understand. Oh my God, I got a level up for fighting the dummy. Let's go. Plus one potential. We love potential. Got some bites. Tiny wing. The dummy stood no chance. Yes. Oh, I see. So I get like EVs, but they're not hidden. Buddy. Reboot. What is happening? I like the passive. I guess it's like abilities. Upgrades? What does this do? Doesn't tell me. All right. Potential. What is this? This is speed, right? Click here or press space to allocate stats. I see. All right, the strength ups brutal power, magical, chance to go first and TP go up, but I need, oh no, I like this. And then this is wisdom, which is use dodge, ups dodge and learning, whatever that is. 
All right, let's increase this. Nice. Sounds good to me. And then what's this? I don't know. All right, we're going to evolve sometime. It's Pokemon. Don't worry about it. Let's go somewhere. Also, I'm very curious how long the demo is. Which is kind of my question for all the demos. Is that... What is that? All right, let's go, bud. Crabble. Crabble's got like sunglasses. Oh, that's eyes. Kind of looks like sunglasses, which I'm going to be honest is pretty cool. So this is neutral brutal. This is win brutal. I have two TP, right? So could I use this twice? What is CP? The honest truth is I don't know. Yeah, I can use this twice. That seems pretty good. Is that good? I'm so confused. Victory. The TP system is confusing me. Wait one second. This what makes sense to you, but it will make sense to me. Oh, no, it does make sense to you. That's terrible. Hold up. Hold up. Made a mistake. All right, we're back. What is this? I got a rock? They can eat rocks? Why can they eat rocks? What's this? Discarded shell. What is that? That sound effect. I need to turn sound effects down. We cannot be listening to that thing chirp the whole time. All right, more crabble battles. Okay, I'm, I'm tr really trying to decipher what's happening in this game. <laughs> Okay, so don't have any, I guess these are items. That's what support is. So this is my TP, I have two. This costs two TP, this costs one. What is the CP? I think BP is like damage. I don't know what CP is. So this does two damage and costs three. Sorry, it costs two, but this is one damage and costs one. Maybe the wings. That crit. I got another turn somehow. Wait, why am I still attacking? Okay, I feel like I just soloed the Krabble, and I don't know why I didn't have to not go, but whatevs. Alright, teleport pad that doesn't work. Level indicator. I don't even know what that is. Okay, wait, off? Yes. Oh, above the wild timer? That seems helpful. I don't think I want to turn that off. Hash salt. Oh, we can do cooking. It does seem like there's a cooking section of the game given that like, uh, I'll time I have to eat and stuff. I'm really trying to figure out this. All right. CP crit points? Like it's crit chance or something? Doesn't seem like it. I can't, I just don't understand. It's the only thing I can't figure out right now. Otherwise, it seems to make sense. And I think the system's kind of cool. I just don't, I don't know. Don't know. All right, more crabbles. All right, so I have two TP now. Let's click peck. I used one TP and dealt the damage. I'm gonna kick peck again. Used one TP to damage. Okay, so tiny win. Okay, then they went. Why did they go that time? I don't understand. Wait, how did they not kill? Did three? Why did they do three? I thought it did four last time. I don't understand.
Alright, back to Putty. Oh goodness, the mewing. Alright. So I still need one for this. Let's increase the TP. And again. Okay, now I need two. Let's increase strength. I think. Seems good. Try and assassinate this Crabble. That did two, but it crit. I could do it again. I have one TP. If I could do it again, I'm out of TP and they go. I have three TP. This should use two, right? Uh huh. All right, that seems pretty good. Also, I don't know what the, what the little bars do. Maybe that's the max amount of times you can use it in combat. Let's join my party. Sure. I just beat enough crabbles and they wanted to join me. Interesting. Ambush? How's that even possible, fam? I'm so fast. So can I click this again? I can. Why could I click that again? Oh, EXP shares auto one. Love that. All right. Well, Fifu is just absolutely pogging on people. But it's hard for me to tell why. Ooh, we could fish. Yes, teach me how to fish, please. Fishy shadows only. Talk to the water. Wait for the aim to hover over yellow spot. Select. I will give it a try. That seems fun. Did I do something? I think it's just like a timing thing. Oh, wait, hang on, wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh, I see. That's really fun. Wait, what? It's a battle? Anchory. Be gone. Wait, where did it get to go? Where did it get to go instead of me? Whatever. I thought TP was like how many things you got to do before they got to do anything. No idea. Too complicated. I feel like this game is giving me a lot of like Oh, it's a rare candy. <laughs> this game is giving me a lot of like I am familiar with a lot of the things this game is showing me and it's really cool but it's definitely giving me Oh, there's two crabbles. I'm definitely getting some level of like I think the interface is not helping it. And which is sad because the game is actually really sweet. All right. Peck. 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 Wait, I did zero? That's no good. I guess I got an armor, I think. I don't exactly know. Crabble leveled up. Let's go Crabble. Snaps to Crabble, everyone. Let's go. 300 bites. I guess I did kill two crabs. Wait, Peck takes recoil damage? I'm so confused. Alright. We're just gonna keep on vibing. The movement is zippy. Yeah, we'll save. Why not? That's very fast. Buy. What can I buy? Heals 20. We'll buy a floppy disk. What does the shield boost do? Gives you a shield boost. Oh. Tracks Tama. Heals. Alright, well I got the disc. That's all I need. Hello. Oh my goodness. These trees. Hard to navigate. Hello, Kai. It's your Nick. We're really on the net here in this game. Oh, this is the, the chef. Hello, chef. Yes, chef. Okay, so I gotta find humans. So sentience are human. So what am I? I'm still a robot? Double floppy. Sheesh. It's a super potion. 
Actually heals for the same amount as a super potion too. What is this? Dive terminal to the subnet. All right, well, I don't have one of those. This game's got a lot of stuff happening in it. I think we can't get past the trees here. Let's go this way. That better not be something I'm trying to find. Oh boy, we're in the binary forest. Hello, why are you here? Yes, please teach me, I'm very confused. Oh, interesting. So every Tama is also a blue mage. Okay. Front Thomas speed and wisdom. Okay. Higher they are combined. So I also want wisdom. I was level four. Am I level four? I think I'm level four. Winter wind. Ice. I mean. Each froze? Again? Oh, it did 10. It did a lot of damage. All right, Crabble's leveled up. Let's go. It looks like I can only use certain techs a certain number of times in a battle, which I think is interesting, like an interesting system, kind of like PP but way more restrictive. Like I can use this four and these two three. I'm absolutely smurfing right now. Come here. I can see how this game would get very, very fun, by the way. Yeah, I think my one, my one biggest thing is just like, I don't fully understand how to like pass through the game it's just there seems to be a lot that's interesting but the game does not teach you it uh as well as it could what a fun show please watch the show yeah, sure. Isn't the show me fighting three Tama at once? Also, there's a time. Is this time? Is that what this has been the whole time? Door is locked. Fair enough. Want this whistle? I mean, yeah, I do. Might as well. It's a free whistle. I do know what it does. I read the tooltip in the other shop. Oh, that's fun. It's like swarm. Is this a enemy? Nah, dog. I do appreciate how fast I move. I'm zooming. Emery Lake. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. Oh, look at this. That's really cool. Yeah, this game's art style is beautiful. Art style, music. A lot of good stuff going for this game. I just wish I understood it more. <laughs> consumables this is like a like a stat up item basically i don't know what the lake does but it's very pretty subnet down there can't go there yet can i go this way nope i'm guessing this is just like a maybe an area you come back to later okay the music was really nice all right let's go let's rumble sapley hiya Got him, coach. Man's took 14. This one is magical. So I guess if I want to make this stronger, I would increase my magic. Crabble be zapping. Nice. Nice. We'd be one shot in everyone. Mm hmm. I think I can increase the battle speed, by the way. Yeah, you can join my party. Beat the poor enemies into submission, then they want to join you. 
Classic, classic monster tamer. It's interesting how there's no like catch mechanic. Just sometimes the monsters join your party. Uh, I need to turn the battle speed. That's what I was gonna do. I think we've seen enough battles to be like, yeah, we can turn it up. Okay. What's that over there? It's a big bee. Level five. I got bigger. How'd that happen? I do not know what happened there. I guess we were all frozen, just chilling. But I defrosted first because I'm speedy. I mean, given how speedy my Tama is, I have a feeling that like, if I'm gonna freeze people and then we're gonna race to unfreeze, I'm favored every race. I guess I should upgrade my main Tama real quick. Uh, potential, sorry. Seven potential points. Okay, I need wisdom to go up. I want this to go up. Wisdom again. And magic up. Sure. That seems good. Oh, yeah. I appreciate how fast the game is generally. Ambush? How are you ambushing me? I'm so fast. I don't understand. All right, let's fight the bee. Hello. Honey thief? Huh? I've not been stealing honey from your hive. I would like a bee, Tama, though. That would be nice. Yes, I do want to help you. I want a bee. I'll think about it. Oh, okay. I think I have to... Go to nighttime. Oh, okay, I see what happens here. Yep. Ambush the honey thief. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Thank you. Where are the quests actually? Here. What does this one say? Ten sentience? Little bro, how am I supposed to find ten people on this island? Alright, we gotta advance time more. This is the classic time time increasing mechanic. Forget playing an instrument or anything like that. Alright. The kid's gone. We gotta be getting close. Hello? No! I need to be night. How do I how do I pass time without the kid? Like actually though. I think I can only have three active Tama. I think. Is there a text speed option? No. Huh, wait, hang on. Let me read the battle speed stuff again. Battle attack animations and turn banners are hidden. Other animations are sped up. Animations at regular speed slowed down. But I had it on fast before. So I don't think I missed anything because there wasn't extra stuff on the screen. I just think I don't know what's going on. And I don't think that's my fault entirely. I just want to put that out there. What does Bash do? I'm reading like the text in the middle of the screen. Like you don't have to yell at me. I am reading the stuff on the screen. This is not exactly clear what the stuff does. All right, how do I wait till nighttime? Do I have to just like yeet around? Oh boy. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I don't need that. Do I just like, oh, what is that? Let's go. Two at once. Attack. Nice. We're defrosting. I'm pecking him. Toxie. We're frozen. I'm pecking. Easy. I guess that is worth more XP because it was multiple timer at once, I believe. I think that's how that works. Roughly. I have a lot of money-ish. Dropped magma rock. Warp ribbon? Oh, that's cool. TP scroll. I mean, at this point, I'm just out here farming. 
Look at me go. I feel like I kind of understand what's going on, but it's like repetition and a lot of context clues that are filling me in. Interesting. Maybe I should have pecked. It looks like the frost status comes off after a number of turns. So I want to use a low TP move, I think. Look, if you're out here and you love this game, please get in the comments and explain to me what's going on. Because I think there's something really fun here. But I just genuinely don't understand. Alright, let's go, bud. Is this the Tama Thief? Oh my god, it's so cute! Tanuki! Uh-oh. This thing seems kind of good. Oh, that actually used up my thing. Oh my goodness. I actually took a million. I need to heal. That's floppy. Wait, I can just use it? Okay. I was going to say it must be used. It. Oh! My trouble, fam. Oh! What? Little bro. Wait, no way. Oh, okay. You took my money? Bruh. Alright, so Tanuki got hands. Is uh first thing we learned. Alright, let's let's allocate some potential. Alright, we allocated. I guess we should like do this too. Uh, what are my techs? Bubble sort. What does this do? Inflicts dazed, which makes some miss, kind of like sand attack. Don't know what that means. I think this is a physical move. Can't really tell. Okay, that seems really good. Native mixed. Let's get HP. TP. Oh, I can't get TP. Alright. Let me take this out then. Alright, we'll take the strength up. Kind of weak. I'll save, I guess, too. Yes. Alright. Can I run? Or is this the fastest speed? I have a feeling it's the fastest speed. Like I said, it's pretty fast, so I'm not complaining, but I was just curious. Why is it level? Are the, are the monsters at night stronger? I'm definitely getting the vibe that they're stronger. All right, let's go, bud. This thing absolutely boomed me last time. What does this do? Oh, okay. The 2x means damage. Okay, that's good to know. Okay. Did more damage. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, what was that? Do I have a move limit too? 1.5 slower. Triggers on first tech. Fails if tech is non-damaging. Okay. I'll figure out how that works, I guess. Down to increase this again. I have so many potential. Why do I have so many points? What? I don't know why I have so many points. Wait, now I have points again. What? Did I not use them before? Did I not use my points the whole time? Bruh. Alright, that explains a lot. <laughs> okay. 
That explains a lot. Okay. I suddenly am more aware of what's happening. Is this the one that had hands last time? Triggers on first tech. What does that mean? I don't know what that means. Is it like a counter attack? There's more? Oh, I think it just triggered. I'm so confused. All right, we did 20. Banger. All right, so it turns out we didn't actually level up properly. That explains a lot. Even though we were kind of just smurfing on people. I was going to say, I was like level 7. I didn't feel like I was level 7. Uh, I guess I'll level up. This thing's like a boss of some kind, I'm guessing. Also, I should use items. Oh, no. Wait. Oh, my goodness. There's so much stuff in here. There's a map, too. That's fun. Uh, I need... Where is my stuff? Oh, memory. Uh... I mean, I'm fine to just use floppies. That's fine with me. Party potential. I need one point. Can't actually do anything with one point. All right. Hello. Thief. Grr. Hiya. Oh, let's go. We one-shot him. Grr. Mad? Mad, 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 mad? Did I do the quest? Did it, I guess. Now what? Do I have to wait? I'm so confused. So just vibe until morning? I got ambushed. How is that possible? I'm so confused. Why can't I use this? I have no TP is why? I... It is impossible for me to explain to you what is happening. Okay, there is more up here. So is there no way for me to advance time other than... Oh my goodness, it's chasing me! Alright, whatever. We gotta rumble. Wait, why can't I use this? I got ambushed so I can't use it? it doesn't make any sense to me. Okay, so that's like a counterattack, kind of? But for some reason, I can't use my other abilities. I don't understand. I don't think I'm going to pretend to try. <laughs> I'm going to use this vending machine, though. Oh, cool. They want stuff. That's fun. Give me the floppies. What's this? Power up. Cooking. All right, we just need some. Oh, no. All right. Gadgets. Okay. Just gonna like vibe out. The rainlands, bro. I have no clue. Hello, mice. What? What happened, man? All right, well, Tama just lip, leapt out of the air, yeeted down like Spider-Man onto me. Probably like shouldn't be out here, man. I'm gonna be honest. Yes, go to the town. Go to the town. What is this? Okay, I finally recruited someone. I don't know what the card does. 
Maybe they'll tell me. Nope. Okay, that's fine. Not important. I really want to do the B quest. How am I supposed to find 10 people? That seems like so many people. I'm here? What? I am so confused. Like, it's actually unbelievable. <laughs> oh, it's a chest. Okay, that's kind of cool. Can I legit... I think I said this already. Can I legit not pass time except when that kid's around? He's only around during the day. I brought someone back. Is that good? Yes? Floaty. Why do I need the backpack? There's running? Oh, the backpack is literally just the menu. Where's the guy I put here? Wait. Oh, I was already running. Okay, that's what I thought. That's good. What is happening? I'm going in. I'm <laughs> I feel like I'm losing it. Do I even want to finish the honeybee quest? Alright, at least I learned what two times meant. These attacks though? I do like that you seem to be able to have a lot of attacks. What is that noise? I gotta fight my way through the crabbles, I guess. Okay, so that is a counterattack. Skull. Uh huh. And then here? Wait, isn't that what I came out of? Why is it mewing? I have so many questions. I think it's daytime now? Speaking of questions. Close. Oh my goodness, it actually sniped me. Level 24, excuse me? Uh. Alright, let's go. No, it's over. Interesting. Little bro, what? <laughs> okay. I think this is a good point. For us to, for us to just chill. So, let's have a chat. So, I think a lot, what is this? Oh, okay. Okay, so a lot of really interesting stuff with this game, honestly. I don't know how long the demo is, but like, you can clearly explore a decent amount of areas and Presumably at least do one or two quests in the scope of the demo, which is quite a lot of content. I feel like I got a good grasp on like the world, which is pretty cool. It's like a digital analog hybrid world, a little bit of exposition, a good look at like the sprites and the music, like a lot of, a lot of the things that are in this game are really good. And I think the core systems are good, but if it wasn't obvious throughout the video, I just could not follow what was happening in this game. Just could not follow. Which is a shame, because I think the system is really good. I think, let me check. I think the game is not out yet. I think it's still just a demo. Nope, the game is out. So 
I don't know uh, what the game is like. So apparently there's 30-ish tameable creatures in the demo, which is quite a lot. Like, and the, and the game is apparently semi-open world. It's really interesting. It's really cool. Like there's, oh my God, I can control with the mouse. That's actually kind of dope. Low key. Anyway, you can control with the mouse too, which is really cool. There's a lot of good in this game and the reviews are pretty positive. And I think if you want to give it a go, the demo is a great way to get pretty deep into what the game has to offer. The one thing I will say is that I feel like I need a wiki to play this game. I feel like I need some other way for these tool tips to be written for me to understand them. But once I understand them, I think there's a great game here. But when the core of your game is the battle system, and I, at least in my experience, have trouble passing the text in the battle system, I think that's a shame because that's the core gameplay loop. And it just is really tough for me to navigate. Granted, I'm doing this blind in, you know, a 40 minute video. This is not a reasonable representation of what the entire game is like. And I think there's a lot of really cool stuff here. And I think if the game clarity increased, or if I just did a bit of work and research and like looked some stuff up and got a better grip on how the system was kind of works, I think I would love this game. I would love it to death. I think it does a great job evoking the 2000s aesthetic and vibe of, you know, Pokemon et al. Uh, that it wants to. And I think it's I think it's great. There's so much to like here. But it is a shame that the core of the game is just so hard to read on first impression. And that first impression is typically pretty important. I think someone that's really into this would be able to get past that stuff and learn more. But I think you might lose a lot of players that might really love this game, potentially myself included, because the system just feels very obscure. Like even, like I'm sure there is a robot I can talk to that will explain things more clearly to me. But the fact that I have to go find that, you know, piece of tutorial text rather than it being presented to me feels like a bit of a miss. Anyway, this was the demo for Anode Heart. Really interesting game. I think if you'd like Pokemon and early 2000 stuff and you're willing to let some of the like clunkiness of tooltips uh, go and really dig a little into this game, I think you'll love it. And I think I might genuinely skim through the wikis and see what things what people say because once it's explained to me I know this game will be something you can dive right into but as far as the first impression goes this isn't a review channel but Try Stuff Tuesday is you know kind of about trying things and in some ways analyzing and reviewing them uh yeah this this game this game falls short kind of only in one spot but in the most critical spot and I think that's unfortunate but Anode Heart really cool you can check it out now if you want the demo as you've seen is Pretty comprehensive. There's way more to do than I've shown off in this demo from the sounds of things. And the full game is also available. It's also not that expensive. It's a pretty cool indie game. Uh, something I might visit again in the future. Again, if you've played this game and want to comment and had a different experience to me, please let me know. I'd love to hear what other people have thought about this. But we'll end the video here. I think this is a reasonably appropriate spot to stop, given that we got axed by the raccoon enemy multiple times. Uh, as always, if you got to this point in the video, I appreciate it. Like, comment, subscribe if you're into that sort of thing. But most importantly, just thanks for hanging out. I'll see you next time.